about is reducing overhead while you actually continue to grow in terms of revenue, right? And I'll quickly touch upon why I'm saying that you have um, lower overheads. Okay. Moving on, what are the business benefits? What do you think would be the challenges to bring up an API platform for your organization? Uh, expose that, expose and bring bring one um, public persona, right? Um, if you look at it, what we what we are looking at is the ability to reach new markets, right? Uh, of course, increased customer usage, increased uh, base of customers, uh, enhancing of your branding. If you are available, um, if you if if applications can connect uh, to your business. Uh, via your APIs, you are providing that um, you know that branding, uh, and and, and uh, certainly it's a case of modernization when it comes to uh, when, it, when it comes to picking up APIs um, today, right? You also have a competitive advantage uh, in terms of uh, being being able to uh, reach out to customers, reach out to application developers against an organization which has not really invested in, in this uh, API infrastructure and API economy, right? Um, the best part of exposing APIs uh, is increase in innovation. And I, and I have an example that I want to show you through, um, an example from, from Philips when they, when they came out with, the reason why they came out with an API. Uh, I'll shortly uh, visit that, that slide as well. Increasing, increasing scale, you're not really limited. If you have a web API, if, you have, if your organization has an API that exposes you know, uh, the business to application developers, you're not really bound to the development team, to the app development team that you have on board in your organization. Right? You have your API, there's millions and millions of developers outside in the world who would probably want to use your APIs, create innovative applications and, and and go in that way. So if you see, you know, if you read the pictures from bottom to the top, um, APIs are, are basically going to be the front end um, of your organization. App developers who are going to consume these APIs uh, are going to create applications that are going to be probably downloaded by millions of customers uh, used in applications uh, which would be uh, either connected cars, you know, the most common one is uh, the smartphone and, and tablets and internet TVs and, and what have you, right? So, so if you see, you're actually, you're actually really increasing um, the, the application developer platform and the number of people on, on that particular platform, right? Now, it's, now, all said and done, we've seen some of the organizations that have really benefited from this, but these come with uh, some challenges that need to be embraced. And, I, and I know, as an organization, as an enterprise architect or, or a business person, you certainly need to know what kind of strategy you'll have to put in place to actually put this together. Right. Um, first one comes from you know the infrastructure. You need to you need to focus on of course you know scaling your platform um, to to serve. To probably millions of um, you know connected clients, or connected devices or, or endpoints, um, who is going to create these APIs for you? It's probably going to be a subset or a superset of um, your backend assets. You probably have services that are being used internally and that 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 you want to expose, right? Um, and when you want to expose any kind of information, the first thing that that uh, the first organization that comes knocking on your door is security. So you need to really look at you know how are you going to secure your APIs and um, uh, you know things like that. So in, in that area, and in terms of operational control, well, you, this is going to be a business. You, you suppose you, you're certainly going to be interested in who is actually using your APIs. How are you going to you know make business sense? Why are you using it? You know you probably want to look at some analytics. And find out how many orders of yellow sweaters you um, you know you had that came from a certain geo or a certain type of um, uh, an endpoint. It could be you want to probably check whether the whether the orders came from a tablet a tablet PC. It could be from a 
It could be from an internet TV. Where did you get that? So it gives a lot of business insight when you when you invest in in the API infrastructure for your organization, and then based on these, you can derive, you know, uh, business decisions. Come on, come out with business decisions, right? So so these are the things that that you need to worry about. How are you going to publish? Once you have your APIs um, ready, how are you going to publish these APIs? 